last time on Styles by Howard. Hi. So I've chosen my next client, Al Janae and Bashonda. I saw her one night at Sue Ellen. It was like the light was shining on her. I think I'm gonna be able to pull off what they're looking for. I think they're looking for street style mixed with chic, something that they can be wearable. It, it just feels like everything is like topsy-turvy with my family, so I can't really focus on who I am. I told you that you need to start calling him as well. Don't say that. I feel like sometimes he just missed the opportunity reaching out to his brother. Let's split up, okay? And then I'll look for the more tomboy look, you look for the more Chris girl look and see what we come up with okay i don't think my family has been whole we had a sense of togetherness or like love when we all were together i don't want to move and y'all still in a bad place like y'all got y'all stuff together i just want you to be okay when i'm gone but miles and miles away okay. she doesn't want to hear anyone else's point of view but her own i ain't seen you in a while and i miss you like for for like i just love you bro I'm the temptation. <laughs> oh, absolutely not. <laughs> How you feel about that? I think we found our winner. That first one, no. 1.7. Okay. okay. Bravo team. Bravo myself. But Shonda and Algernay looked really cute together. The young ladies' dance moves, they were good. I give her that. Could you have done better? No. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I feel like, I don't know, it's, it's life changing. You know? One, two, three. SBA! Okay, y'all still don't got it. Cut, print, beautiful. Thank you guys. Dynamite. I do have an event that I'm putting together. It's a adult field day. I never heard of it. Yeah, it's an adult field day. It's gonna be a few games. I think I'm gonna do like four different teams. Other than that, then what's been going on with you? Honestly, been in school, really trying to get everything so together. Oh, you back in school? Yes, well, it's really like a tech boot camp. Oh, okay. So right. I was for like three months and they teach you UX design and at the end you get an apprenticeship. So I'm really trying to get into the tech industry because that's where the money okay. is at. Okay, so oh, give me more. <laughs> The shirt matches the shoes. Yes, and the bag. That, but the bag is not. Traylon walks in and I see two different environments. I see safari, wow. cheetah print, and then I over here I see floral print. Normally his stuff flows, but it was not flowing today. It got held up at the dam. It was absolutely not. Let's talk about Algen A and B. I think it went really well. I think that we executed it as much as we could as far as clothing, destination. I feel like it was a smooth process. It was smooth. I will say we just need to be more mindful of time, kind of schedule out a little bit later. Kind of have that extra time allotted in the time that but we have because things happen. to be on our, like in our defense, yeah. it was more so the hairstylist. Yeah, because yeah, we was running in our heels at this point trying to get there. Absolutely, because it takes me. Okay. Okay, so yeah, that brings us to what I want to talk about today, which is our next client. So we're doing something different. I've never worked with just a moderate intellectual disorder. Um, mm -hmm. Her name is Sabrina Law. She's 35 years old. Much like, you know, our aunt, um, she doesn't have any, like, difference or know anything. She's just happy, fun. She loves fashion, so that's always cool. And I, I don't want to limit someone because they have something that they can't control and they still love fashion so i want to be that piece that connect that bridge that connects the gap so i want to do a shoot with her we're going to do three looks for Haley. i need you to get the photographer i love working with Faison, so we might use Faison. shameen i need to get sizing oh i did get sizing from her but i need to get we get we need to get another dress so i'm going to give you sizing so you can find another dress for her in the red family she likes red so i really looked forward to meeting with her because she loves fashion and i thought this is this will be a great way to give back to the community because oftentimes people feel like that they can't be styled because they don't look a certain type of way or they don't dress a certain type of way or they don't have the budget so this is my way of saying you know what you can let me help you 
I'm a professional stylist, why can't I? Is there any new update or anything? Well, I did have a few, so for starters, money, 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 money. Is it a check? It's a check. Only checks it's in the white envelopes. Check. Can I? Okay. okay, so I did check the P.O. box this morning and we received a check for Thank shoe you. deal. So, Haley bringing up the shoe deal check. It's like, where's my cut? <laughs> where's my portion? I understand that I'm supporting you, helping your dreams, but baby, where's my cut and everything? Where's my little coin? The shoe deal check was used for um, expenses. Every day they come over my house, they drink wine. They eat my food. They they smoke. Like, for God's sakes, like, they I can style for free. Like, advice from a professional stylist. Like, what? I think that's it for today. Good job, you guys. If there's not anything else, y'all are free to go. I'm gonna stay here for a few minutes and send me emails. I'm about to go to lunch. It's been really good. Oh, can you give me a... Uh, no, not. Lunch, you can't. You should owe me lunch for my last time. Girl, you finally came last time. Say hello, cash up. That's the only time you get to me. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Today I'm meeting with Sabrina. Oh my God, I've been waiting for this day. I have been trying to get looks and see what she likes. I spoke with her on FaceTime for a brief moment, but I get to meet her in person today. Her and her mom are coming by my best friend Star's house, and I'm excited to show her the looks. Hola. Hey, hey babe. Oh, where can I put this? Here, hand it to me. Out. Okay, okay, okay. It always smells good in here. Okay, so. I definitely want to come over here because I know that we were talking on the phone briefly about mm -hmm. Sabrina, and I definitely want to get her to do a shoot. I'll okay, have some some, some pieces for her. So you think, how you think, I mean, you invited her mom and yeah, her, they're right? they're on the way. They're on the way. When they get here, I want to be kind of fun, kind of show them some pieces of what we have, okay. um, give their honest opinion, just have fun with it, and then I want to give them like details on the shoot and what mm -hmm. we're going to be doing. Okay, yeah, I love that. Sabrina gonna be super shocked. So. Okay, yeah, yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited. You know what? I'm pretty Pretty nervous to meet Sabrina only because I know how to talk when it's someone that I'm trying to impress or someone that I'm trying to um, have a conversation with but you can offend them and you can kind of talk to them kind of harshly and they can take things the wrong way so I am pretty nervous I just want to watch what I say because I can talk I'm out a minute and I just want to make sure she gets the information and kind of it gets excited about this hi hey. oh, how are you hey. Nice to finally meet you. Nice to finally meet you. I'm Trey Howard. Welcome to the house. We got some food for y'all. Y'all thirsty? I know it's kind of getting hot in Texas. Uh, it's fine. So, let's get into it. Okay, my name is Trey Howard. I am a stylist here in Dallas. And I work doing a lot of editorial and commercial work uh, mm -hmm. with different brands. But I thought it would be super awesome. I was talking to the star. Uh, she was talking about what I, what we do and she has a lot of clientele as far as what she does. And I thought it would be super dope to have you guys in style, Sweet. style mm -hmm. Soprano for a shoot. Are you excited about that? Yes. I think that would be super cool. You already floral for the springtime, so you're already on trend. So you're already doing it right. But I want to come in and do a full makeover, head to toe, hair, makeup, clothing. I want to give you guys 100% of my time and effort and talent. So I want to do it right. I want to do it by the book and how I usually do for my clients. So I want to make sure that I'm here to do a fitting to make sure that she looks flawless. There's no seams undone or anything for her look, okay? Yeah. How's that sound? Good. Good. Okay. Bad. Bad. So, Mom, Miss Wala, tell me your story growing up and just existing with okay. um, having a child who has had a disability. Well, first of all, I was uh, in the military. I mean, cupcake, and uh, it was it. It's a challenge. It's a challenge experience, and uh, she was born in Germany, and we didn't find out till later that she. She was challenged, and uh, it was hard, you know, throughout. Just because you're challenged doesn't lose your spirit as a human no, being. And no. I know she was as bright and enthusiastic yeah, and excited. Mm -hmm. So tell me about like, how was her excitement growing up? How did she grow up and feel like the love of her parents and joy? I don't think she realized that she was special needs, but, uh, and to me, she wasn't. 
Absolutely. Because of the love. Absolutely. You know? And Miss Safrina, how do you feel about life? What do you what's your goals in life? How do you feel about things? Well my dad I'm single. I had no, I had nobody. <laughs> oh, you single? Okay, listen, we're gonna find you a date. <laughs> <laughs> what does fashion mean to you? How do you feel about fashion? Good. You like it? You like skirts, you like pants. What's your favorite pants. color? What's your favorite color? Red. Red? Where's your favorite color? Okay, cool. Mom, how do you feel about her fashion? How do you how do you like how she expresses herself with fashion? She loves clothes and she picks her own clothes out and stuff. She does a good, you know, makes a good choice and stuff. We're gonna get you in she, all of that. Yeah, she loves going to church. And I was raised in the church. My grandma had me in church and knowing about God. Yeah. So with having your faith so strong, how did it help you in situations? It helped me be resilient. Absolutely. And then as a Christian, we were brought up in the church and it's just like, you just have to put your faith in God to move forward Absolutely. with everything. And we've, we've had some struggles, but I, God made it, you know, we made it through. Absolutely. The grace of God. Through the grace of God. I love that. I love that. I'm yes. excited to do this. I'm honored. It's my pleasure. Do you want to try on some clothes? Yes. I'm trying some clothes. Okay, so I have some things um, I have to start help you with to put on, see how you feel about them. I don't have heels or anything. I'm going to make sure we have that for the actual day. And then I'm going to get with my team about hair and makeup oh. and make sure that you approve the look before we give it to you because we don't want to have you anything you're not comfortable in, okay? I have a fabulous okay. photographer. Location is so, so beautiful. Oh, so beautiful. So beautiful. So I think you're gonna have a great time. You excited? Can I get a high five? Let's do it. Okay, we're gonna get you some clothes. Let's do this. The cupcake is good, right? Mm -hmm. You got five glasses. It's just like, I just feel so happy to do this here. Like my style and like, giving to people that really just enjoy stuff like this. It just makes me feel good. I just feel super emotional looking at Suprina, trying her outfits and get excited about fashion. It's so universal and a lot of people say like music is universal. I think fashion is such a place that you can let yourself speak without saying anything. And so when she starts to really love what I'm putting on her and gets excited, it just makes me feel like I'm doing my part for the community, my part in life. And I'm finally understanding what God has for me. And it's such a blessing to really know your passion and really strive in that. So y'all like everything? I love it. You, love it. you like it? Mm -hmm. Yes. You like which one's your favorite? The skirt. The skirt? Okay, yeah, I'm glad you like, you like the skirt. You like the red too, and all of it, really, don't you? Yes. Yeah. Okay, but yeah, we're going to two, so two fit and two look perfect, and then two, we had some alterations, so I want to get two more looks that definitely represent the other two and do it justice. We're going to get shoes, um, makeup, hair. It's going to look so cool, so cute. Are you excited? Yes. Okay. You good? Okay. Yes. Your mom, do you have any questions, concerns? Do you trust really me? Nice. Oh, yeah. Okay, great. Yeah, I'm excited. Exactly. I'll be FaceTiming you guys to show y'all oh, hair and makeup so options. <laughs> and then the next time we'll see you guys is for the shoot. I'm going to teach you how to pose, okay? <laughs> Pretty. So tell me, how did you feel about meeting Trey Howard today? I think it was awesome. What about you? Good. Are you nervous about the clothes that Trey uh, pulled for you guys today? No, they are beautiful. Really nice. And how do you feel about doing a photo shoot? Is, is, is this going to be your first time doing a photo shoot? Yes, it's the first time. You're excited? Yes. yes. Coming up on Styles by Howard. We're on camera, Jay. We're going to get us playing. First of all, I'm going to need you to relax. When he was putting the harness on, his was like showing. It was just out. And Trey loves to show his So I am planning to move to Mexico for a couple of months. Just doing something different. Girl, what are you doing? I'm doing what God intended. And I'm using my passion, using my talent for other stuff other than what I usually do.
Probably gonna sit up doing stuff the later ride. in the evening. It's we need to make a bet on something. Show. Like if we win, then what? Are we in teams? Is everybody for themselves? No, absolutely not. Shailen, you haven't even worked out I am since a last year. First place <laughs> all star, honey. I called Haley. I called Shameen. I told James. I put them all in the car. So we're gonna rock climbing because they talk a good game. But let's see if they can climb it. It's giving. I'm about to win. Let me take an L. I'm a very athletic person. Um, well, I used to be athletic, but I still, I'm still kind of athletic. When we pull up to the rock climbing pace, I was like, okay, this is dope. This is fun. This is different. But bitch, when I seen how tall that was. I was a little bit skeptical. I didn't know if I wanted to continue doing it. I didn't know if I wanted to, you know, back out. But at the end of the day, I gave in and have fun, do what needs to be done. What size you get? I got a nine, and right now my shit doing this. Get new ones. There's, you said there's these no more teams. Uh, <laughs> so they have us put on these little shoes. And for like, first of all, it's COVID. I ain't done nothing to be like, this is. These shoes, first of all, it doesn't match my outfit. Let's start there. All right, just come on, just throw, crunch them up and come on. The Chinese people, they, the Chinese people, they bink, they break their foot to be getting their shoes. Well, we're not Chinese. 11 and a half. Let me get a 12. This lady behind me. I know, I see. You need to be more aware of your surroundings. I see your function, not be curled. I look over to the damn left, it's a damn Asian lady. I'm like, shit, did she hear me? Shemaine done walked off, left me hanging. Haley done walked off, don't really know me. I'm like, I be offending people. I'm not a racist, y'all. I just be, words just be spilling out my mouth. Please don't, don't, don't judge me, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I need a small one. That shit is loose in my waist. <laughs> Don't nah, don't touch me. <laughs> We're on camera, Jane. We're gonna get us flat. First of all, I'm gonna need you to relax. Stop yelling. You don't want me to. Okay, 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 okay. Y'all, 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 y'all. Everybody knows Trey got a a big like that's no great secret. He's tall, he's skinny. When he was putting a harness on, his was like showing, it was just out, and Trey loves to show his You never have a Y'all, we he's never a bigger person. I don't feel like I chose the moment to argue with James. Like, I was trying to tell him, like, don't touch my And he was like, yeah, we're here. I was like, James, don't do that in public because you never know who watching. And it's some haters around. And we ain't got to get into no altercation because people are hating the way we are showing our compassion. So just chill out. And he felt offended. <laughs> It's giving slack up here. <laughs> I'm ready. Yeah. It's giving Spider Man. <laughs> I, I'm not. Look <laughs> 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 James, James, let me down, okay? Like, I just want to get down, honey. Why is it taking? I'm just bouncing against the wall, bouncing against the wall, and I'm not getting down. I'm not understanding. So I just feel like Jesus, like, let me down. I don't want to do this no more. Don't nail me to the cross. That's, it's that's not kind of easy. It's kind of like easy as I sort of figure out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> <laughs> when it comes to my athleticism, I can do everything on the ground. Jump rope, come up in the air, my feet touch the ground. I can do push-ups on the ground. Everything is done on the ground. I have a big foot. Call me big foot. I am short with big feet. Call me La Cienega. So what? Then you look down and you got somebody that's half your body size trying to make sure they hold all of your weight. And trailing is funny. I get laughing because I want to pee on myself. <laughs> What can I do? Go, yes, James. Yeah, there you go. That's good up there. Okay, that's good. That's not bad. Woohoo! Thank God, I'm ready to be released. Okay, you gotta let go of the wall, bud. Huh? You gotta let go. Let me down. I don't know. I, I just feel like I shouldn't have picked this. There you go. Let 
right? <laughs> I got makeup all on that wall. <laughs> we tried to give a look. <laughs> <laughs> So that was fun, right? Y'all, we had a good time. I still ain't peeing yet. Right, Clyde, man? Yeah. Man, shit. Yeah, it was, that orientation was That's long. That's a different huh? type of athleticism. I thought that was the, I thought he was our uh, guy the whole time. Yeah, I thought yeah. he was. No. Like, no. I thought he was our own. Person, yeah. Throw us to the wall. Yeah, absolutely <laughs> not. Not ready for that. <laughs> I do want to kind of like check up on y'all, catch up with y'all, what, what we got planned for the next few weeks. So, I am planning to move. Where? Oh, not, uh, to uh, another apartment? Not to another apartment, not to another city. So I am planning to move to Mexico for a couple of months, just doing something different, refresh my spirit, because this year has been a tough one. If y'all know, you know. Mexico, but, yeah, I, was gonna, I was just going to say, why Mexico? Because it's, it's just different than after watching all those videos on YouTube, I think it's a good starting point. I found me a black community in Mexico, so I'm just going to go with it. Like, you know what I'm saying? So it is what it is. Oh my God. So I'm sipping on my little drinky drink or whatever, you know, getting a little tipsy or whatever. And Haley brings up the fact that she's been, like she's moving to 10 bucks fucking too. And it's like, girl, what are you doing? It's not a bad thing or nothing, but it just kind of threw me off. Like, where are you going, girl? Like, kudos to you. I'm happy for you, baby. But where are you going? Why Mexico? When you leaving, like it's anytime soon. We got the floor brunch, we got Mother's Day. We got still things to take care soon. of. Like, how soon, how Haley? Soon. Like, you need to at least give us a 60 day notice. <laughs> okay, put it in there. Within 60 days. Well, we got to talk about that separately, like on the phone, because so we got some stuff in there we need to, to take care of before well, you go. I mean, our committee, don't get me wrong, wrong, but then again, like, you know, Damn I gotta come sure. first, committee. you know what I'm saying? So I gotta put my dreams first. It was kind of like a shock factor for them because they did not know. This is something that I kept secret from a lot of people in my life life including my best friend trey with the team it's not like i'm leaving them hanging i'm still here showing up for everything that we're doing executing and fi finishing out as much as i can before i go because i don't want him to think that it's just like oh we're doing this and then you're just leaving no 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 but at some point i did have to put myself first and this is something that i've been planning but i hate that i had to leave but i gotta go and what are you gonna do out there like are you just gonna like continue your hit by Haley like out there like what are your plans so i do have a remote job already set up mm -hmm. and then i'm going to be training so i've been getting in contact with some people you know of course nothing sticks until you get down there yeah right. but i do have that set up so i'm excited just to see you being a different economy i mean different place yeah. do you different plan on money. staying staying or are you just planning on like Test, testing the waters. The testing feet. the waters out for right now. It's about six months and then you go like there. You about to go with them. Oh so if you like it, what's your plan next? I mean, if I like it, then I'm gonna stay longer, get residency. But then it's just like, I'm still trying to figure out what I'm doing with my life in general, because like nobody give you a handbook to this life shit. And it's like figure it out, figure it out. Like boom, throw it to the wall. So just kind of refreshing. I need some new change of scenery. I don't know how to feel right now. She tells me she's moving to Arriva Dirty. What is it called? Habuntaka? Tulum. It's one of them. It's one. It's in Mexico. Not the little Mexico we go to where you can get like little grande apachadas and archatas. Real Mexico where the donkeys and stuff. And I'm really like bummed because we really just started working. So I don't know because yikes. She's moving. What about y'all? Uh, for me, I think um, I'm starting to like feel more comfortable going up and then I'm seeing like people that's not in my life. I mean, Jayla talked about my dad. Y'all know I don't know him. I do know him, but I don't know him right now. Yeah. He's very estranged. So maybe in the future looking towards that, I mean, he got a new baby. So I have a younger sister somewhere floating about. I have an older brother somewhere floating about. So how do you feel about that? Like, yeah. I really don't care enough, but James says he thinks I care, but I really don't care. Don't care about what exactly, like the you know, siblings? Or like, I don't care that he's not in my life, like I don't okay, care. Okay, well, as far as your siblings, like would you like to get to know your siblings, like? I mean, I know my brother. Or you just brother, don't I care, just, like, I just, okay, I'm just, I just have a sibling out there. I feel like I'm numb to the situation, it's so old. Yeah. I'm so old, I'm so over it, like I'm done with it, like I really have to, I don't need him no more, so it's like. Do you want a relationship, like just in the future? It's you know? not needed, though. I don't think it's needed. It would be nice. It'll be nice, yeah, but, but it's not I mean, needed. I'm on my way to California. I got bigger, bigger things headed my way, so I don't. It's not gonna make a break. It's not gonna break. A, it's not gonna make a difference. So I don't know. I'm, and I'm. I talked to my mom about it, but I think he should do it. 
Do you think it'll bring him some closure from your standpoint? For sure. Mm. We'll see. For but, sure. Um, at least we have two more big events coming up. Um, just get off the work topic because I can't yeah. stay off the topic of being at work. But we got two more events coming up, and I just want to make sure that we are focused, that we close out this um, summer with the bang. I'm glad y'all came here to help me this summer, help me get my ducks in a row, really help me get with the team. So I want to do this, like, keep this going as far as, like, our little team we have. I know you're leaving, so I'm going to have to, like, bring in some new people. I know I'm going to L.A. I'm going to have to bring in some new people. But I do appreciate y'all for sticking it out thus far. And I just want to say shout out to us for really getting stuff done. Shout I think this us. is a great foundation, like a good starting point. Yeah, because you know sure. the in and out is of how it works. And so when you bring others on, you know you what know. to expect. Yeah. Yeah. Cheers to new beginnings. Cheers to a bag. And cheers to... Cheers without it's my summer. dreams. <laughs> okay, well, I don't know why I hit mine. It's not a shot. Oh, I do it Maybe this tastes like straight juice. It's about to be gone. This tastes like Simply Lemonade. Yeah, that's why we don't go nowhere. Black people don't go nowhere. They say it use the other door. We do want to do the parking lot Right here. Okay. All right. More convenient for folks to get in. Hi. Oh, yes. Central air conditioner. Yes. I'm good. Fine. Nice to finally meet you. I'm Trey Howard. I'm Trey. I'm Shamine. Haley. Haley. James. All right. Yes, the team. The team. Nice to meet you. Yes. Second half of Jaden Dora, Jade and Dora so, okay. Finally, it's the day of Sabrina's shoot. I have been working nonstop trying to get this shoot together and make sure that it goes off without a hit. A couple of like trying to find a studio, but I remember my friend Jade kind of opened her new studio. So we're gonna check it out and see what's popping. This is everything. Congratulations, I'm excited. It's already up and going. The industrial feel is everything. We both love that. We love glam and industrial. Yes. Okay, so my model is on the way with her case manager. And um, basically, um, she's there just to oversee everything. It's one of my best friends. Like I said, she has an intermediate disorder. So her mom is here as well. Her mom is going through like a cancer mm -hmm. type of thing. So I just want to do this for them and give them like a give back moment as a stylist. So when they get here, um, I'll make sure she's fitting everything and we should be good to go with you. Excited, yes, thank you so much, let's do this. We're at the studio right now, getting everything ready for Sabrina, making sure everything's right, outfits are laid out, shoes are, you know, everything's just in order as it needs to be for a smooth shoot. And I'm also excited to meet her because this will be my first time working with somebody that has a disability and, you know, I'm just excited to see how everything will flow and go. Come on, y'all. I'm glad y'all came in at that air. Ooh. Ooh. This is cute. Yes, we got the jewelry, we got the shoes, we got everything. It's cute, right? Cute. It's cute. Okay, come on, let's come over here. So we already looked at the dresses. Remember, we tried on the dresses earlier, right? Right. Okay, so we already know we got the cute look. We're gonna start with this one, okay? Okay. Okay, we're gonna have mom and star help you. We got some shoes, and then when you, when I, when you get dressed, I'm gonna put some jewelry on you and make you look real cute, okay? Uh -huh. Y'all already look fabulous. The hair is Thank cute. You. We have to have some fun, okay? Let's okay. have a high five. All right, let's do it. I love one of the outfits that Trey brought. Like, well, actually, I love both of them. It all, like, the shoe just all came together. It really went against my doubts, if that makes sense. Let's move the bag. Okay, put your hands back to your side. There you go. Yeah. There we go. I love it. Super cute. Put both hands in your hair. Step up just a little bit. Step up just a little bit. Right there. Looks super cute. Yes, yeah, so cute. It made me feel really good to be able to be a part of something like this. To be able to help somebody, give them confidence, you know, 
even if they have a disability it made me feel really good inside it's something that i would like to do more of people they like to count out a certain type of demographic like they don't exist and i'm just like y'all everybody has feelings everybody wants to feel good everybody wants to feel confident so i'm very proud of trey for taking on this type of project yes what they saying what they talking about back with they ain't gave you no money so cute Get loose, get loose, here. Okay. Get loose. Yeah. Come on. I feel like that people they are a gift from God. So anytime that they are connected and show love. I think that it's blessings from him. So to know that she is grateful and that she's appreciative of me, this kind of warms my heart because it just lets me know that, you know, I'm doing what God wanted me to do. I'm I'm doing it for real. And like, it really just lets me put my talents to other use besides, you know, doing like upper echelon fashion or anything like that. I really kind of like wanted to do something for, for the community. Okay, so I think it went really good. She was a little nervous at first. But I think that we pulled through me coming in the shoot. So we're gonna go take look at look at her pictures and then choose a few that she kind of likes. Also, I was looking at this space for our photo shoot that we have coming up at the end of the summer. But today, good work. Everybody, good job. Um, she looked really good. Yeah, the second outfit was my favorite. Right, okay, thank you. To me. Excuse me? I'm walking out. <laughs> I got that one. I like that. Yes, yes. Oh, the background's everything. <laughs> yes. That one's cute. This one's a baby. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta get it. One down. Oh, yeah. Yay. Yay. So when she yeah. gets done editing, <laughs> I'll send it to you, and then we can post them. That's we can right. put like, <laughs> a little frame to blow a picture up, right. and then that'll be my present to you, okay? <laughs> Thank okay. you. I'm super excited and appreciative and honored and pleasured that she really had a good time. I think that letting her keep all the outfits, she's gonna go to church Sunday, show everybody up. And I just feel like I was super just like happy and warm my heart because I'm doing what God intended and I'm using my passion, using my talent for other stuff other than what I usually do. Okay, thank you so much for everything. We enjoyed. Great yeah. job. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> thank you. Thanks. We want to make sure that you have any cards and oh, yeah. things like that that we can promote with because we're oh, definitely coming that. back. I know a lot of photographers I would love to that want to shoot time. here and then models, whatever you guys need, let me know. Styling, I know y'all got fits in there. We appreciate you for everything. And next time, hopefully, Jade's here so we can see oh, yeah. her because we had the DJ Duffy suit and it was bomb. So, yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. Yes, yes. 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 But thank you so much. We appreciate you. And um, we'll see you next time. Come back anytime. All right, it's a wrap, y'all. <laughs> it was nice meeting nice you. Meeting it was nice meeting you. Nice meeting you, guys. Thanks for coming no in. No problem. <laughs>